Hey, what's going on guys? Welcome back to another Stormworks video and welcome to episode 22 of our classic career survival series. In today's video, we'll be modifying our rescue boat and hopefully fixing the overheating problem that we have so we can make our way down to where we had an accident with the sharks. <laughs> anyway, hope you all enjoy it. Let's get started. Alrighty guys, here we are in the workbench. We're going to start by getting rid of our radiators and redoing this cooling system because it, it doesn't appear to be working. <laughs> but uh, anyway, uh, we'll make a bit of room here. So my plan is we're going to get rid of all of these and that up to there, boom, boom, and boop. And then all of this on this side as well, up to there. All right, so we're going to keep the pump. Now, what I'm thinking we might do, we might put the radiators along the bottom of the boat so we can expel the heat into the water. I might do that. I'm not sure. With the other engines, you can get away with pumping water through, like seawater through the engine, and it cools it down. I'm not sure if it works with the modular ones. But um, anyway, we might just use the radiators for now. So what I might do, I might go radiator. We'll grab some of these ones here, and what we'll do is... Hmm, how big are they? That big. All right. Um, let's go like that. So there's one there. We might turn it around the other way. Actually, no, we'll leave it like that. That'll be fine. Just like so. All right. And then we'll just have our... Pipes come up through here, okay, and then they'll go in there, and then we'll make the fuel tank a little bit bigger. <laughs> uh, actually, no, we won't do it right there, will we? Oh, yeah, we might have to. <laughs> I don't know if this is going to work or not, but anyway, let's um, hook it all up first. So, we'll just go angles, and turn these around, and face. Now, we want to go from in, out, in, back around. Is that what we want? <laughs> yes, that's going to go that way. That will come in, come out over here. And that will go in there, and then this will come out, and maybe it can go forwards and come out there. I think that's what we might try and do, see if that works. Hopefully it does. It better had. <laughs> I got no more ideas. Okay, that there. Okay, cool. Then we'll get some regular blocks, and we'll just fill in that area so it doesn't leak to about there, I'd say. So that is all sealed off. That takes up a bit of room in the fuel tank, but it's not really the end of the world. So what we might do just to make up for it a little bit, what if we just raise it here a little bit? <laughs> If we just go along there and bring that to there, that'd be fine. That, yeah, kind of makes up for it. That'd be right. Um, right, let's get back down here and where the radiators are. So then these two, one's going to go into here, doesn't it? So let's uh, come down with this like so, boop, and we'll connect that with this one. And then the other side can maybe connect on the back of this. All right, guys, that's all done. So what I've done is I've added a second pump onto there as well so I can help pump in and pump out and circulate the water a bit more. And that goes down into these radiators. So hopefully that works. I'm not too confident in it, but um, <laughs> all we can do is hope, right? Uh, so that should be fine. Uh, but next, what we'll do is we might fill in the bottom of this. So we'll just get some blocks and go like that. That should all be sealed, I believe. I did gray on the inside back, so it doesn't matter. Uh, we'll paint all this gray as well. And we'll bucket tip all these surrounding pieces, just like this and that one there. Perfect. That looks awesome. Um, now, next, we need some sort of weapon. So, harpoon gun. Is that a thing? Oh, yeah, spear gun. That would do. Um, so, we'll grab that and some ammo. So, what we might do... We're going to put a rifle in here as well. <laughs> Bunch of weapons. Uh, we might just put them on this wall. Why not? Should be fine. Is there anything on that wall? No, it should be right. Um, so, we'll open up a little spot. Maybe we'll go down to here. We'll put one on the wall, like so. And then we'll put maybe... Six lots of ammo on the wall should be enough. That should be heaps, actually, but we'll we'll put six there. Um, we have 26 grand left. How much does this cost? 52, yeah, should be right. Uh, and a rifle, just in case. <laughs> you never know. Uh, put that there. And rifle ammo. We'll put six rifle ammos on the wall as well. Two, three, four, five, six. Perfect. All right. Uh, now, we'll fill that in, and we'll paint all that back to the right color. Um, we better get a paintbrush out and go red and white. Alrighty, that is all done. So we should be right to spawn it in now, hopefully. Do we have fuel at this base? That is what I'm not sure about, actually. Do we have to go and get some? Oh, no. Oh, I think we probably do. We'll go and have a look. And there is absolutely no fuel in here. Perfect. <laughs> so let's uh, respawn that. And that's saved as well. So we'll close that. We'll go and get our fuel truck and we'll head up and buy a bunch of fuel. Alrighty, guys. We're going to take the truck and trailer. We're going to fill them both up. Or as much as we can, uh, we'll spend about... $15,000, I think. Oh, that's better. Yeah, we'll spend about fifteen grand on fuel. Hopefully, that's enough. <laughs> uh, all right, let's creep forward with this thing. Yes, I quite like driving this thing. It's it's pretty cool. I really like it. Um, we'll turn this around. We'll head up that hill. Yeah, $15,000 of fuel. I think that's all we can really spare at the moment because we need the rest of the money for our boat. But that's all right. Um, I'm not really too sure what to expect when we get down there, if the sharks are going to still be there or not. Um, I sort of... 
hope they are, just so I can shoot them and whatnot, <laughs> to be honest. But, um, yeah, I don't really know what to expect. So, we'll come up here. Super careful not to beach that trailer. Because, <laughs> yeah, I keep breaking it. Um, all right, let's go over here. We'll fill both of these bad boys up. We'll just come a little bit closer. Something like that should be just fine. All right, open that door. And open this time. Very nice. Um, we'll grab our hose. Connect up to there. Turn that on. And we'll connect up to the buyer. Now, how much money? 58. So what if we bring that down to about 42-ish? Something along those lines. Is that going down? Yes, it is. Very good. That's going up. Very nice. Now, we'll open up this little port. Boop. A little bit of air out. Yeah, I don't know if that helps or not, but um, I guess we'll see. Anyway, I'll keep an eye on our money, and I'll be back in a moment. Alrighty, guys, we're getting awfully close. I might stop it in a second. Yeah, about now, I think. Uh, oh, put that back. Turn that off. Take that back out. Um, this hose actually goes in our truck, doesn't it? Plug it in there, and turn that back off. Yeah, 41,000. Okay, it's a little bit more than I was hoping, but hopefully we've still got enough to spawn our boat in. <laughs> um, oh, handbrake. Uh, we didn't end up using the trailer at all, but that's all right. Um, so, oh! Oh, did one go. Perfect. Um, so, I would like to add a pump on our boat as well before we leave. I nearly forgot. Um, so, we can suck the fuel out of the other boat to take weight off it. And so, we can have a little bit extra fuel. Because I don't think this is going to be enough somehow. <laughs> and if we get two stranded boats out there, we're kind of stuffed to say the least. But um, we'll see how we go. Uh, right, we'll come up here. Can I respawn this back? Yes, I can. Perfect. Um, close that. Now, how much money have we got left? 62. Okay, that should be plenty. How much fuel we got? 8,000 litres. Oh, that's really not much. Um, where's the refinery from here? It's not far, is it? It's just there. Um, even if we go down and get our boat, we can always steal a bit of fuel from the creative dock, I suppose. <laughs> yeah, that's not a bad idea, actually. Um, we'll set a waypoint down here. How far is it? 14 k's. Um, hopefully, we have enough fuel to get down there. Otherwise, we're in a bit of trouble. If we get two stranded boats, that's that's the end of this, <laughs> this playthrough. We're going to have to start again because... Um, we have no money to build anything else or buy an island or anything, so we'd be pretty stuffed. But that's all right. We'll go down here. We'll modify our boat quickly. I just want to put that new pump in because I don't think there's a pump on it to suck fuel in from something else. Uh, let's have a look. So there is our fuel. And which one is that? The one <laughs> on this side here. What? That's not it. Is that it? Oh, that's it here. All oh, right. Okay. So if we suck from there, is that what we've got to do? I don't really know. Uh, what if we just do the same on each side? We just put a pump in here. That'd be right. Uh, pump. Grab one of these. And is it three long, is it? And turn it around. Boop. Is that the right way around? Yeah, fluid out. So it's sucking in. That's what we want, I'm pretty sure. So we'll go uh, toggle button on the top of that. And that would just be to pump in. I don't think we need to pump out or anything for any reason. All right, there we go. They are both wired into a toggle button that allows us to pump in. So we should be right. We'll just paint that a nice white color. Perfect. So save that as the one with the weapons on it. We'll spawn this bad boy in with the tiny amount of fuel that we've got. And we have 14 kilometers to sail. And actually, guys, the last thing we're going to do, we're going to actually add a um, join the two tanks together. I think that's what we're going to need to do as well. We haven't done that yet. I've been saying I'll do it for a while, but um, <laughs> we'll do it right now. So where's the best place to do that, do you think? We might put it in the front. Um, I think it's just as simple as building like a little area that comes up and over. I think that's all we're going to have to do. So if we go like this... We just got to make sure we box it all in correctly, that's all. Um, so go like that, and then we'll come along like so. Yep, that goes into the fuel tank. All right, then this will come up and go over to the other side. That is the plan anyway. So we'll go like that, bring that up to there. Yeah, is that, yep, same on that side. Very good. All right, we'll put that over to there like that. That one over to there. Very good. This this could even work, you know, with a bit of luck. Um, we'll get some more pipes out. We'll put some straight ones in. We'll go like that and that. Very good. Um, so let's connect up all of this. So that's got to go over to there. Okay, perfect. That's all sealed in. Then this side, there's just a couple more pieces here. And we go like that. Perfect. So that is like a cross pipe now that goes over to the other side. There's a hole there though. <laughs> um, yeah, I can fill that in. Should be fine. All right. And that goes straight to the fuel tank, I believe. Yeah, let's just make sure everything's all good. Yeah, it all looks pretty good. Hopefully. <laughs> Hopefully that works. Um, so we'll save that and we'll spawn it in. All right, the crossover pipe works quite well. We have 8,000 liters. Uh, that's just between the two tanks, but <laughs> uh, we don't really need the left or right gauge anymore, but that's right, we'll just leave it for now. Um, jump in here, we'll turn this bad boy on. Yes. All right, now we'll reset our waypoint. We'll go back down to here. Should be fine, 14 kilometers. All right, let's um, get out of here. Oh, 
On the move. Very good. All right, a bit more throttle. Yeah, we're coming out of the water a little bit, but that's okay as long as it doesn't do a backflip on us. Uh, that stupid sound of slay noise, man. <laughs> Those radiators, yep, they're all spinning. Very good. So hopefully that fixes that problem anyway. Um, we'll keep an eye on it. Our speed 110-ish. All right, very good. Now let's look out for islands today. That'd be a good idea. See, there's two that we could hit or even three. <laughs> let's not hit any of them. Uh, all right, we'll go down and check the engines in a minute. Actually, we'll check halfway through. I'll be back in a second. All right, just a heads up, guys. We got a $6,000 reward for cleaning an oil spill, apparently. <laughs> uh, I don't know why. We didn't do anything. Um, we're not going to hit that one, I don't think. Right, I wonder if we could quickly go downstairs and have a look on the engines, just to make sure everything's all good down there. There's oil everywhere, isn't there? That's where we had our accident. <laughs> anyway, we'll go down here. Let's quickly check on the engines. Uh, 37. All right, we'll come back down maybe closer to when we get to the other boat. Or if the boat slows down, then we're going to know that something's wrong. <laughs> anyway, I'll see you guys soon. Oh, another 6,000 bucks. I'm not doing anything. How much about now? 21 grand. I mean, I'll take it. <laughs> Let's keep cleaning more. <laughs> Very good. Anyway, I'll see you guys soon. All right, guys, we're just about here now. Let's, um, I'm going to try and back up to this thing and connect our winch to it. Unless, yeah, yeah, I think we're going to pull that one backwards because the front's going to sink, I think. Um, so let's go somewhere here. Very good. We'll put this thing in reverse. Very good. Rev it up a little bit more. Just like this. Very good. All right, I'm going to try and get really close to that thing so I can just hop across while I connect the ropes up. That is the plan. Um, we'll keep coming. Keep coming. Come on. You can do it. Just very slowly. Something like that. Perfect. All right, let's go and grab a rope before they get away from each other. Boom, boom, boom. Go, go, go. Uh, we got to connect this one to the winch downstairs if we can. Is that going to be my face? <laughs> Let me get through here, please. Uh, there. Perfect. All right, now we need to get out of here. <laughs> uh, actually, we can use these ladders here. Get on the back. Very good. Now, what we can do is we can let this one out a little bit more. We left it out to about 30 meters or so. Should be enough, hopefully. Um, are we pushing that thing away? Hopefully we're not going into the bankment there. Should be fine. All right, 24. All right, just about. Yeah, 30. Yeah, that'll do. Very good. All right, let's go get back in our boat and we'll start pulling it straight away. Let's not muck around here. Um, so we need to take it out of reverse. So clutch down. Very good. Out of reverse. And we need to go forwards. All right, here we go. Just very careful. Take up that slack on the rope. Yeah, okay. Yep, super fast apparently. <laughs> all right, we are on the move. Very good. Hopefully this all goes very smoothly. It is actually turning, which I'm surprised. It's going really well. All right, let's um, give it a bit more throttle. Um, yeah, is that going to pull us into the water? It shouldn't do because the winch is very low down. It should be all right. How fast are we going? 55. Okay, that's probably the best we're going to get. I don't think we're going to go much faster than that. Um, all right, let's head around this way a little bit more, and then we'll set a waypoint to where we actually need to go. It's working, though. Our plan is working. Um, hopefully this thing is... A, yes, it's filling up water. Look at that. It's pretty full. Both sides. Yeah, this side's very full. <laughs> uh, but that's all right. That's fine. It should be all right. Um, we're about to be going. We need to go around that island, and we need to head all the way back up to Spike Cakes. That's a big distance. 13 kilometers doing 50 k's an hour. <laughs> and we have 5,000 liters of fuel. Hopefully that's enough. Hopefully everything works in our favor. Look at that poor little thing back there. Look at that lights flickering in the corner there. <laughs> um, anyway, um, I guess I'll see you guys when we get there, assuming it all goes fine. I was going to stop off at the creative base and grab some fuel, but I don't think we're going to worry about it. I think we'll take the risk. We should make it, shouldn't we? I would hope we do. How much is that? 5,300. Oh, we, maybe we should get fuel, you know. Oh, there's still fuel on that boat there. Um, should we check that and have a look? Let, let's get a, let's do a few Ks and then we'll stop and we'll go and check that boat and see if there's any more fuel on it. Alrighty guys, we have about 10.7 kilometers to go and we are down to 4,500 liters. <laughs> um, so what I might do is, before that boat sinks, I might try and get the fuel off it. So I might, um, actually just stop completely here. It will just slow right down. Perfect. Um, yeah, boat's still on. That's really good. Uh, we'll chuck it in reverse, and we'll head backwards a little bit. Uh, turn the throttle up. All right, a bit more throttle. And we're starting to go backwards yet? Yeah. Yep, there we go. All right, very good. So we'll stop right here. Perfect. And I'll turn the throttle down as well. 
save on the fuel. All right, let's jump out and we'll connect up our filler hose. So we need to go over like this, um, that one onto uh, there, sorry. <laughs> and we'll go around here, jump aboard, very good, and connect it to that one uh, there. Why do I keep trying to connect to that? Anyway, uh, we'll go back on here and we'll... Oh, there's some noises. <laughs> you guys hear that? That didn't sound very good. Wait, let me on. Can I get on my own boat? Oh yeah, perfect. All right, let's see if we can fill up. Is that working? Okay, so there's no fuel on this boat. It doesn't look like it anyway, or 35 liters. It's going down, but our fuel in our boat is not going up. So I'm not sure what the problem is there. It is not going up at all. Okay, um, okay, we're not gonna have to worry about it then. We're gonna have to leave it. Boop, and we'll put that back. Let's just keep going. What I might do quickly as well. Uh, <laughs> I might shut this door so it doesn't fill up on the inside. Um, I guess I'll shut these too. Not that it's going to make any difference whatsoever. It's already going down. Uh, but yeah, if we can create like a bit less resistance for us to pull, then it'd be a bit better. So let's jump back in here. Uh, everything's all good. Let's start going forwards again. I can't remember if I turn reverse off or not. I guess we've got to find out. Yep, reverse is back off. <laughs> Very good. Right, let's keep going forwards. See if we can get... There we go. All right, perfect. Uh, slow down a little bit. I want to come out of the water. Very good. Okay, slowly ease onto the throttle. Okay, awesome. Okay, well, I'll see you guys in... Oh, actually, I don't even know if we're going to make it. 4,300. we got 10 Ks to go. Oh, dearie me. We should have stopped off at the creative island there. Unless we will make it to here. No, we won't make it to the fuel up there. Unless... Is that a dock? There might be a dock here, actually. Let's do that. I might set a waypoint to there. Not that that's... Uh, it's not really that much closer, is it? We'll set a waypoint there and we'll aim for there for now and see how we go anyway. Um, I'll see you guys soon. Just an update, guys. We have about a kilometer to go until we're right at this island. I think we're going to make it all the way home. So I'm going to set a waypoint over there. Um, 3.8 k's to go. Oh, it's a bit risky. 2,700 liters. I really hope we'll be all right. I guess we'll find out. Okay, okay, guys. We have less than a kilometer to go. We've nearly made it. <laughs> um, this boat, let's have a look. Oh, it's very full of water for both sides. <laughs> anyway, that's all right. We're, we're nearly there. Um, we're only doing oh, 34 kilometers an hour. Oh, dear. Six RPS. I think the engines have overheated again. Um, yeah, let's go and have a look, actually, because the boat slowed right down. We were doing 50 at, with the start at one point, but um, let's see. Yeah, 94. Uh, hmm, they're getting quite hot anyway, and that boat's also getting quite heavy, filling up water and whatnot as well. But that's fine. We have made it, which is amazing. Hello. <laughs> um, now we have no money and no fuel. Perfect. <laughs> we have $21,000 in the bank and 50 grand there. So we have 70 grand. So we'll get some more fuel and whatnot. But um, I'm pretty sick of this boat overheating, to be honest. I, I thought that that would have fixed it, but apparently not. But um, anyway, um, yeah, we've made it. But I'm very happy with that. So that allows us to move on to new things next episode. Um, Although, that being said, we still will need to do some more missions to get some points and more money before we can build that tank that I want to make. Um, a lot of you guys want a VTOL as well. I dare say one will be coming, not just yet, but we, like, we really need some more money to build this tank out. It's what I really want to do next, but I don't think that's going to happen for a little while now. <laughs> um, but anyway, we'll see how we go. All right, we're just about here. I don't want to return this workbench early. I want to get that boat right over here before we do anything. Uh, we'll see... Unless possibly we could build a VTOL next episode. I'm not too sure. We'll see. See what I, I think is best. <laughs> see what I decide. All right. We, we are here though. That is amazing. Very good. Um, how much fuel we got left? 1,800 liters. That is absolutely nothing. All right. We are here. Awesome. So let's stop the boat. Very nice. Awesome. We made it. That is, that is great. All right. Let's take this thing back. Very good. Get rid of that. Perfect. And this one, edit vehicle in workbench. Awesome. Very nice. We did it. <laughs> and we have 127 grand. Ooh, that's pretty good. That is pretty good. You know what we should do? Hmm. How about we go get our fuel truck. We'll get some more fuel and we'll go and fill up that hangar over there. And next episode, we might build a VTOL. Unless we build one at this dock and let it float. Maybe that's a better idea. How much fuel have we got here? Enough? <laughs> Let's have a look. Uh, 2,000 liters. That's probably enough to play with, actually. All right, well, that's what we'll do next episode, guys. Um, we'll build a VTOL. Well, we'll start building one anyway, probably over the course of two or three episodes. I know you guys really, really want one. And later on, or even we could now, we could put some weapons on it. That'd be pretty cool. And how are the bases going down here? Let's have a look. Um, what's going on? 89%. That's pretty good. 79. 
I was checking a few 76 anymore. This one. Oh, they got that one. <laughs> uh, what about this one here? Uh, 100% still. Oh, okay. What's that? Harbor base. Right. Mm, we might have to go down there with some weapons. <laughs> oh, dear. Anyway, guys, that will do us for today. I'd like to thank you all very much for watching, and I'll see you all in the next video.